Welcome to Seik Math Academy. In this lesson, we are going to see trigonometric ratios expressed in terms of other trigonometric ratios. For example, sin A will be expressed in terms of cos A, tan A, secant A, cosecant A, cot A. Okay, see. First, sin A. What is sin A? Is equal to sin square A by 1 minus square root of sin squared A. What is square root of sin squared A? 1 minus cos squared A. You know that sin squared A plus cos squared A is equal to 1. Now you see it, this sin A is square root of 1 minus cos squared A. Okay. Next, sin A expressed in terms of tan A. How to express in terms of tan A? Sin A I can, I am dividing by cos A, so I am multiplying by cos A. Why I divide by cos A? Sin A over cos A is tan A. Okay, sin A over cos A is tan A. This is equal to tan A. Times. What is cos A? 1 over secant A. What is secant A? Square root of secant square A. What is square root of secant square A? Tan A is equal to square root of 1 plus tan square A. See, now only tan tan is there for sin A. You got it? But for this, you have to know secant squared A is equal to 1 plus tan squared A. This formula, I have to recall. Cos A is equal to 1 over secant A. This formula also, know that secant squared a is nothing but 1 plus tan squared a. Got it? Okay, next sin a. Sin a expressed in expressed in uh, cos A, tan A, then cosecant A. It is very simple. Sin A is 1 over cosecant A. Okay? Over. Then, this is a very simple one. Then sin A will be expressed in, in terms of cos A, in terms of secant A. How to do it secant A? Sin A is sin a is equal to square root of 1 minus cos squared a that we have already done now square root of 1 minus 1 over secant squared a right square root of secant squared a minus 1 over secant squared a okay then square root of secant squared a minus 1 over secant a. This is sin a is expressed in terms of secant a. Okay. Then sin a will be expressed in terms of cot a. How to express in terms of cot a? Sin a is 1 over cosecant a. We can just reverse of it, but I am still Okay, we will do from this one. Sin A is equal to or tan A over 1 plus tan squared A. Sin A is equal to tan A over 1 plus tan squared A. Okay, now tan A is nothing but 1 over cot A. 
this is nothing but 1 plus 1 over cot squared A. So 1 over cot A divided by cot squared A plus 1 divided by cot squared A. This will come 1 over cot A divided by cot square root of cot squared A plus 1. This I am taking cot A here out. This, this will cancel. So what will be the 1 over cot squared A plus 1. This is very elaborate way. We no need to do like this. Now I just recall another simple method. Sin A is equal to, this is a very simple method. Don't follow that method. Sin A is equal to 1 over cosecant A. 1 over cosecant A is equal to 1 over cosecant square A. 1 over cosecant square A is equal to, what is cosecant square A? 1 plus um, cot square A is equal to, this is a very simple method. That method is not required. Okay. But uh, how we can go, that is that will be helpful to that. Okay. Sin A equal to 1 over cosecant A, 1 over cosecant squared, uh, square root of 1 over cosecant squared A. Okay. Then 1 over, square, 1, over 1 plus cot squared A. Thank you. Okay. You have to know all these six formulas. Sin A is equal to 1 over cosecant A, cos A is equal to 1 over second A. Uh, tan A is equal to 1 over cot A, cosecant A is equal to 1 over sin A, second A is equal to 1 over cos A, cot A is equal to 1 over tan A. Got it? Then tan A is equal to sin A over cos A, cot A is equal to cos A over sin A. Just copy it out. Sin A is equal to square root of 1 minus cos squared A. Sin A is equal to tan A over 1 plus tan squared A. Sin A is equal to 1 over cosecant A. Sin A is equal to square root of second squared A minus 1 over second A. Sin A is equal to 1 by 1 plus cos squared A. Let us see in cos A. We will express cos A in all mode. Cos A, I can write directly 1 minus sin squared A. Because cos A is square root of cos squared A, square root of cos squared A, 1 minus sin squared A. Cos A, how I can represent in, in terms of tan A? 1 over tan A. 1 over, uh, sorry, 1 over secant A. Okay. 1 over secant A, square root of secant squared A, square root of secant squared A, 1 plus tan squared A. Okay. Then cos A, how, now you see cos A is only tan squared A, cos A is in terms of only sine. Then cos A is equal to 1 over uh, in terms of cosecant A, how to do it? Okay, cos A is equal to, okay, here from here we can do it. 1 minus 1 over cosecant squared A. Cosecant squared A minus 1 over cosecant squared square A. Then cosecant squared A minus 1 over cosecant A. Okay, very simple. Then cos, cos A in terms of uh, secant A, 1 over secant A. This is very, very simple. Okay, cos A in terms of cot A. Cos A in terms of cot A. Uh, what is cot A? Uh, I am dividing cos A by sin A and sin A. So this, this, if we cancel, it is a cos A only. This is cot A. Cos
cot A. Sin A, I am representing 1 over cosecant A. So cot A is equal to 1 over square root of cosecant squared A. Cot A times 1 plus cot squared A. Got it? So sin A and cos A we expressed in all the terms, uh, all other trigonometric ratios. In my next lesson, you can see tan A, cot A, how we are expressing. Thank you for watching.